There were fingerprints in the pistol found in the boat. They are clear prints from Mr. Edgeworth's right hand. W what? Order, order. So Mr. Edgeworth's fingerprints were found in the water weapon? Uh, yes, your honor. Judge! This is a weapon in question. Uh, accepted in the evidence. Members of a court, we now have a pistol using a murder and a bullet found in the body. Detective! Y yeah, 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 sir. What's the bullet found in the bo body found fired from a pistol? Yes. The ballistic markings in the bullet match a pistol. Hmm? Hey, Nick. What does he mean, ballistic markings? Shocking! To imagine someone here does not know something as basic as ballistic markings! N Nick, he's staring at me, glaring at me. Very well, I'll explain. Actually, Judge, you do it. Well, uh, hmm. Mrs. Martin, he's got a fingerprint on what gun. Apparently, there are stuck mar marks in each bullet of fire. Make some of these ballistic markings to see which gun fired the shot. It's quite accurate. Indeed. This leads to one inevitable conclusion. A bullet fired from the victim's heart was without doubt fired from his pistol. This pistol, which you may recall, was covered with defense own fingerprints. O order, order. This makes it look like Edgeworth did it. Well, Judge, I sure it's almost decisive. Yes. Honestly, I can declare a fake verdict at this point. However, you wish to hear a witness speak, no doubt. Very well. I'm somewhat fatigued. So I'll, I'll take a quick break. I will call my witness after recess. Which will last 10 minutes. Judge! Y yes? What are you doing? A 10 minute recess? No! But, but, uh, wait, I... Just buy your flimsy gravel and get it, man! <laughs> Ow. I'm just cordial to take a 10 minute recess. Who's running this court anyway? I was going to say, that was a 2v continue moment already. Jeez. Edruff, what's going on here? Your fingerprints are on the murder weapon. Uh, um. And that foggy photo makes something clear. Only one who could have shot the man in person in the photo. True. Was that you in the boat? Yes, it was me. What? You must believe me, I did not shoot him. Th then who did? I don't know. You don't know? Weren't you right there? I heard a gunshot from very close by. Then the other man fell from the boat. I can't say why, but I thought at the time he sh had shot himself. Y you mean it was a suicide? That's the only explanation I can come up with. Huh? How am I can convince anyone of that? Say, Maya. Huh, what? Any progress on Mia? Oh. Sorry. It's no good. Ugh. I know. I'm no good with anything, am I, Nick? If I can't call my sister, I might as well not be here, right? Yeah, you're fucking useless. Nope. <laughs> I need you here. Of course you're not. I need you here. I see you're always trying to help out. Even if you don't actually help, it's a fault that counts, right? It's okay, Nick. You don't have to make me feel better. I don't know anything about trials or defense. What's well, more, I'm a spirit medium. We can't even contact spirits. Ah, oh, everyone has their off days. I mean, I've just been getting lucky lately. But you never know when my luck is gonna run out. Really? Whoa, 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 right. Don't jinx this case any more than it already is. <laughs> it's bad for my heart. Oh, oh, sorry. Whoops. <laughs> Why would you say that in front of your client at any time? <laughs> so this is hilarious, that always makes me laugh. Court is back in session. Mr. Volcarma, tell your next witness. Then it's not a hot to take a stand. I will consume the world. Not a hot. You're a research student at university. Then I am. Good. Begin by telling us what you saw in the night of the incident. 
I don't add anything trivial or subjective. Wink. Understand? Y'all need to learn some manners. UNDERSTAND! Yeah, I understand. I understand. I did the wrong voice. Yeehaw! <laughs> Oh yeah, your test while you're please. I probably need to turn down the volume and some of my yelling. It was Christmas Eve, just after midnight, I reckon. I was in my car. I had this bang come from the left. I looked at the window and saw two gents in the boat. Then there was another bang! There was an airy thing on the lake but that boat. Enough! Huh? Judge, she happened to take a photo of the incident. This has photo, except the incident. Well, this is a surprise. This looks like the very moment of a murder. I just saw some. Here. Oh, uh, I don't really think it's suicide. But how does that make any logical sense? If, um, the gun's pointed at him and the picture gets taken whenever the bang happens. So surely that is the exact moment the gun is fired and it's being pointed at that guy. The, um, well, I should, probably should say, what's the name I keep on forgetting, it's sorry, Richard Hammond or something? Robert Hammond? So how are you going to be suicide? Or will we find something out? As the witness testified, she looked at the lake when she heard a shot. So her boat's on a lake. So the man in the boat with the victim must have been the one who shot him. Yes, it was to defend Miles Edgeworth. I really hope that my teacher doesn't become a lawyer and just, you know, fuck me over. Order, order, order. I will have order. Well, Judge. The evidence is decisive. A very little doubt about this case. Very well. The court finds the defendant. Objection. Oh wait, wait, your honor. I haven't cross-examined the witness yet. A cross-examination? Pa! We have a photographic proof. What question could be for possibly be? Photos worth a thousand word. Ah, uh, they all read guilty. You lose. Or, do you claim you find a contradiction in her testimony? Very well, if you have to, you may cross-examine the witness. You may only flounder and ask meaningless questions. You'll fail to find anything. Then I have you held contempt in court. Uh, Nick, contempt? Contempt in court, you know. I, I guess I understand. What are you going to do? Do you really think there's contradiction with facts or testimony? Yes. I think I noticed one little thing. Well, I'm surprised, Nick. I didn't find no side thing. Right, let's take him on. Y yeah, I got a bad feeling about this. I understand. I will cross examine the witness. Very well. You have fallen into my trap. I pray to your shit. It's, it's no waste of time. Huh. So have we found a contradiction? Are we just bluffing? Find out in the next episode of Phoenix Wright Ace Turning. So that thanks guys all for watching. Please rate, comment and subscribe. And I'll hopefully see you guys all next time. To see how we do. So hopefully see you guys all then. Bye. <laughs>